If you're looking for an easy workout to get you moving this summer, well, Betsy is here to show us how effective short burst workouts can be. Thanks okay. to FAC for sponsoring this segment. Hey, hey Betsy, Hello. good to see you. Hi yes. Again. <laughs> so, yeah, what do you have for us? What are short burst workouts? So, short burst workouts. It is a myth that you have to work oh. out for hours on end in order for it to be effective. Okay. You can do a couple of really quick workouts throughout your day, even two or three minutes. If you can get five to ten minutes in two or three times a day, get your heart rate up, get your blood pumping, you are going to get a ton of benefit from it, especially yeah. if you're sedentary. And when I say sedentary, don't think somebody who just sits and watches Netflix all day long. If you have a desk job, you are technically considered sedentary. Gotcha sedentary okay. because you are sitting, sitting most, of your day. most of your day so you're shortening up through your hip oh. joints everything is compressing down so just get up and move it can be simple you can just kind of squat yes you're always having us do squats always like having this. Squat. <laughs> I feel, always feel like my this form is, is off so important form on squats is not hard at okay, all good. Be right outside your hips yes but take a look down because our hips are never as wide as we give them credit okay, for, okay? So just right outside <laughs> Your toes are either forward or just slightly out. Mm -hmm. You want to think about making your hips wide. I know we're trying to make ourselves more narrow, right? right. But I want you to think about pushing your hips out like walls are going to squish you. Okay. Make your Ooh. hips wide. And then there's an imaginary chair right behind us. We want to keep our chest up and we want to sit down in our imaginary chair. Then press through your heels to stand back up. Easy enough, right? Yes. So a squat is one of your easiest, best workouts to do. You can get your heart pumping. You can add to it lift to your toes. Yes. You can lunge. It doesn't have to be a big lunge. You okay. can step back. You can take your hips up and over. Open up your hips. Oh, yes. We have oh, yeah, that. we do that. Uh, we've done this one before. Yes. That always, like, right? I don't know. It's something Especially I don't do enough, I feel like. when you sit a lot or if mm -hmm. you cycle, um, moving those hip joints around, you're going to hear them snap, mm. crackle, pop. Yes. It feels so good. <laughs> yeah. Even yes. just stretching, taking your arms over, but if you're using your whole body when you do it, you're getting your heart rate up, right. plus you're moving those joints around. <sighs> so when you do have to sit back down, your blood's flowing, everything's working out. Yeah. You know what? Better. Something I did this morning, literally, when I went to the closet to get my shoes, uh, I, I, you I, groaned. I, I went like, yes, but I went down like this <laughs> to pick them up instead of just bending over like that. I like, am like, so and proud I of you. I, I, I mean, my heart immediately started pumping a little bit extra. I right? Feel like. so, because you are using so many more muscles in your body to come down okay. and then lift yourself back up. Right. You are using them correctly. So your body is pushing blood all over the place rather than just letting it drop to your head oh, yeah okay. bringing it back yeah you're gonna get that heart rate up yeah, that's a good thing i can't believe i was thinking that at like you know 4 30 when so i was that's right. that means betsy's been a good makes my you. heart happy I know. yes i love that <laughs> yes betsy let's talk about hydration Ooh. and, yes. and yes. kind of what are some key things to remember when it comes to hydrating as we're working out and uh doing our fitness routines absolutely so we want to stay hydrated all day long, whether we're working out or not. Okay, yeah. that's going to help everything okay. move better. Um, our body just really needs to stay hydrated. But especially when we're working out, mm. you need to resupplement what you sweat. So if you sweat a lot, you need to add even more water. Josh just told us it's going to be crazy hot. Yeah. <laughs> even more important to add that water back in because we might not even realize that we have dehydrated before it even happens. Yeah. Our heart rate runs faster when we're hotter. Um, our, we sweat without having to do much. You might not even notice it because you're so warm. Put that water mm -hmm. back in. And it's not just water. You can eat watermelon. Yes. Any, if, it, if it is juicy or mm -hmm. it is crisp, uh -huh. it has water in it, yeah. and you get water from food. Throw some electrolytes. If you don't like just plain water, throw some electrolytes into your water. Okay. Give it a flavor. Add some ice to it. Make it fancy looking. Crush your <laughs> ice up and throw some fruit in there. Yeah. Whatever it takes to get that fluid in your body, get it there. Is there any difference between like a like a pre-workout, during the workout, post-workout? When do you want to hydrate? Right. So you want to be fully hydrated before you even start. So if you're okay. drinking water regularly all day long, carry your little water bottle with you. You're drinking water regularly all day long. You're going to move into your workout a whole lot better. Okay. During your workout, if you feel like you need a drink, do it. Okay. If you don't feel like you need one, no big deal. Don't worry about it. Don't be like, hold up, wait. I, I got to grab my sip of right. water. Yeah. Right. You're fine. Now, after, I do want you to start drinking almost immediately after your yeah, okay. workout. Okay. Put it 
back. back. It's yes. going to help cool your body back down. It's going to help flush everything out. Yeah. And then you're already telling your body, okay, we're ready to put it back, so it's not going to start panicking. Yeah, okay. I love that. Like that. Yes, thank you. I know you can't see this, but one thing that Betsy brought with her today into our studio is her water bottle. My she had water it with bottle her, right? it is so, always by my always side. With you. Thank you, and thanks so to FAC Betsy. for sponsoring these segments. We really appreciate you coming in with us every week.